Next, I'd like you to think about lectures and how they've been beneficial to you or, or otherwise. And you've all experienced lectures? Yes, yes, yes. How many is the biggest group you've ever sat in at university? Um, 300. 300? Yeah, probably about that for management. Wow. St. George's. Yeah. So you sat in groups of 300. Um, Just tell me about your experiences of lectures. What value do you think lectures add as opposed to, say, working from an online learning environment? Erica, you start. <laughs> um, yes, they're valuable. Why? Um, because, because it's different. First of all, it's a place where you have to go and you have to study, and that's where you gather your information, uh, the way I see it. If you were to stay at home and get your information, it mm. wouldn't... It, for, for a while, maybe it would work, but then you just grow lazy and not go uh, and not make the effort. Um, also, establishing the link with the the, the lecturer is important, yeah. I think. Um, it's important to get the, the examples, she says, or he says in the lectures, um, the, 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 the experience they use from, because most of the, our lecturers either, either have worked in industry or um, have some uh, professional experience. So um, we don't really get that from just reading the lecture slides. So, yeah. Okay, so if I said to you, what's the benefit of a lecture when you all sit in this huge group as opposed to, say, getting stuff from the online learning environment, what would you say the, the pluses are? Start with you, Eric, and then I'll start. Yeah. The experience that of some some lecturers use their personal experience to mm. illustrate examples. So the examples, yes. illustrations. Illustrations. So um, I'd say that's the main plus okay. because you can't get that if it's not being explained to you. Right. Um, but okay. it, of course it depends on the lecturers. Mm -hmm. Not all of the lecturers do that. Right. Some of them do. So everybody else pluses. Let's go start from Ben. Uh, Any yeah, sure. pluses? Okay, so um, one of the things I quite like is Personally, I struggle a bit with lectures, but one of the things I do like is if you do have, if you don't understand a section of a course or like a part of a lecture, you can get the lecturer to re-clarify, which is quite good. Whereas, like, yeah. so they can explain it in a different way. How would you do that then, if there are three hundred of you? Oh, well, generally my lectures are a lot smaller than three hundred. Oh, right. Is only that's just like the biggest uh, one. So you put your hand up. Yeah, and um, so quite often, because there'll probably be other people in there that are sort of struggling, what they'll do is. So they'll, they'll go through it their normal way and then they might say, oh, okay, and then they'll try and do it from a different viewpoint uh, or a different angle. So you're actually interacting really with the lecturer in that way. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and interrupting him, yeah. Yeah. In a good way. Yeah, in a good yeah. way. Yeah. I hope. Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> okay, thanks, Ben. Jay, any pluses of lectures in your view? Yeah, it depends on different people. Right. There are some talented students in my department, they just can learn themselves and they don't need to go to the lectures. Mm -hmm. And it, it depends on which step, which uh, progress you are doing for your study. And uh, someone just, uh, before they come to the university, they have worked for several years and they have lots of background knowledge. And some lectures, oh, this knowledge I've ever learned, I don't need to. And I can learn something else to further improve my career. Yeah, that's it. So different students have different modes of learning and, and yeah, so some and will appreciate lectures more than others. Yeah. <laughs> Any comments from you, Alex, about lectures and advantages or disadvantages? Yeah, I think the, the structure's definitely good. Mm. Um, I think it's, yeah, it's a time when you're there and you're kind of engaging with whatever it is on the course. Um, so I think that's, that's definitely plus. I think it varies massively between um, the, the lecturers in terms of how, how engaged you are with it and stuff. Mm. And partly that's to do with the material and partly that's to do with the lecturer. Yeah. Um, yeah. But I think, yeah, I think probably it varies massively from them being really helpful to being yeah. practically useless. Okay. 